Verse 33, and Jacob said, Swear to me this day. And he swore unto him, and he sold his birthright unto Jacob. So Esau, <laughs> he was more concerned about his flesh in Eden than his birthright. And so that's how Esau is today. They, they don't care about the Lord. They don't care about the scriptures. They've twisted the scriptures to suit them. And we're, we don't know any better. We've been deceived. When they brought us into captivity, especially Judah, they stripped us of our language, our heritage, our culture, everything. Our names. <laughs> they gave us new names. New language, new culture, new heritage. And so we don't know who we are. We go by whatever they call us. If they call us Negroes, if they call us African Americans, if they call us black, that's what we go by. <laughs> but the scripture said we're Hebrew Israelites of the seed of Abraham. We're of the tribe of Judah. But we've been deceived. So we try to assimilate to be like our oppressors to act like them to think like them to look like them because we don't know any better but that's all been prophesied in the scriptures you, that's why you got to go back and restudy and reread the scriptures everything that's happening is happening for a reason that's why the lord is waking us up he sent his word to follow us wherever we go whatever we do they've tampered with the scriptures to try to change them, but they didn't understand the context of the scripture. So they've changed names, but they didn't change the context. The context of the scripture still stands. It's only about God's chosen people from Genesis to Revelation. But we don't understand that. We've just been going off of what these fake 501c3 corporations, pastors, preachers, and teachers of the Antichrist church system, these corporations, been telling us that God loves everybody and it's about Christian. It's a lie. It's all a lie. <laughs> That's why the scripture in Revelation said, come out of her, my people. <laughs> We're the chosen people. We're the church. Hebrew Israelites of the seed of Abraham. It's not about everybody else. <laughs> I don't care how you cut it, how you look at it. <laughs> it's about God's chosen people. And that's who he's coming back for. Esau sold his birthright. Jacob said, okay, fine. <laughs> That's all I wanted. And so now the birthright went to Jacob. That's why we're the chosen people. 